just don't let it drop. He said, don't let it drop. Just let it drop. Come on, Michelle. Yeah. Stop looking to see where it's going. There you go. Come on up. Come on up. Sarah. There you go. Okay. Pull that back and back. Keep it off, Sarah. Come on up. Don't let it drop. Don't let it drop. Don't let it drop. Right there. There you go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on up, Lisa. There you go. Bring that. Lisa. You're doing long, right? Stop, stop, right here, let's go. Quit looking, Michelle. Quit looking. So you're gonna see it on video, your technique's perfect. But when you move your head, you're gonna make unforced errors. Now, I agree, I like the way you take it back a little farther, Sarah. But at the same time, you wanna get used to not taking it back at all, too. That's more advanced, not taking it back at all. Okay. Well, actually, let's talk. See, that's pretty good. That's pretty good, uh, Trish. See, you're starting to get more and more relaxed. Now, when you switch lines, put your racket in your left hand. Get this on, yeah. Get that arm relaxed. Good. Wow, that was it, Sarah. That was it. You're doing it. Look how much more power you're getting with that's called effortless power. Excellent. Good, Michelle. Good, Lisa. Now, you can't go straight up. You got to go forward a little more. Because your technique is good. Now we want to get it right at the target. Now, Lisa, you have no idea where you're hitting it. Think about where you're hitting it and make the ball go there. Okay? Because your technique is fine. You just kind of lost your concentration on where your target is. Okay, everybody stop. Where's our target? Where are we aiming, David? Uh, let's, go, let's go both shots at the red. Okay? Just so I can see and you can see on video where your leverage point is. You have to have leverage, which means you're turned in that direction. Really good, Laura. Good technique. Better, Lisa, the first one. Wow, Sarah, now you're totally relaxed. Good. Really good. Look at the ball. Good, Laura. Or uh, Trish. Now, Trish, I don't even want you to look on the next uh, on the next backhand stroke. 
I just want you to try and hit it dead center of the strings. Good. Uh, no, if you want to take it in the air. It's kind of hard with the, that drill, but... <laughs> but, uh, now that would be the next level, is to take these as a volley lob. Absolutely. Yeah, not like that. See, you missed it. Okay, let's stop. I love what, uh... Yeah. This one you can barely even know. Yeah. That's list number 30. Ah, uh, Jerry will do it. I won't do it. <laughs> Uh, turn your board just a little more. That one needs the right leg. Yep, perfect. Now, just swing like you don't care. Just let it go. There's the stroke. That's called effortless power. Very good. Very good. All right, now the challenge for you is the tip of the racket now has to go right where you're aiming, and then you finish by touching the left side of your body. And if you wanna do more topspin, all you gotta do is be a little more uh, lateral with your motion, but you never try and force it. Good stroke, Lisa. Wow, Sarah, nice. Let's get rid of that one. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's a goner. Good, see, but that's where you projected it. So now you gotta project it lower because you're getting so much power. Good, lower. There you go, you just figured it out, Laura. Okay, and everybody stop just for a sec. Make sure that as you go back to get balls, make sure that you're looking at everybody. For example, Sarah has the most experience with this. Lisa has a lot of experience too. Her Their ball tosses are right in the perfect spot and they're in total balance. They're starting to let their arms go and they're hitting them hard. Yeah. Okay, so Laura, I'm gonna show you. <laughs> you make a good target. There you go. Oh, oh you moved my basket. I was going right in the basket. 